شهر رمضان الذي أنزل فيه القرآن هدى للناس وبينات من الهدى وبينات من الهدى والفرقان فمن شهد منكم الشهر فليسم ومن كان مريضا أو على سفر فإدة من أيام أخر يريد الله بكم اليسر ولا يريد بكم الأسر ولتكمل العدة ولتكمل العدة ولتكبر الله على ما هداكم ولعلكم تشكرون الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين نبينا محمد صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وأصحابه وبعده أقوم سجر ما السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وأنما صلى الله لا زمتري أقوم سي برن تعري أبوجا نجيريا ويومك ميدا مكسابا زام دورا إنه قوان أجيا هاري أنزمونا أجيكن سورة ياسين زام تاشي أكان آية تسبا إن عند الله تعالى بجرمات وكاكي تشيوا لينذر من كان حيا لينذر من كان حيا ويحق القول على الكافرين تو tambaya mungita bayani akang watu anabi muhammad sallallahu sallam Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala be karantat dashi wakiba shiba ma wakiba ni saan na qur'ani ba wakaba ni achi kalbu mini na Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala wa be sawkarga anabi muhammad sallallahu sallam ya zaman tuwa abun karantawa Abi mfahim tada aiki Takuma kira izu wa garishi Tubaya kala ta'ala ya musuraddi Mekarifi Shiwa matayin an Nabi sallam Matayini na jagwaran shi an Nabi wa gabaki da Nda kuma shi ni mabi pichi Shikin a aram gabaki da Sabu da haka shi ba mi waka ni ba Ba mwa ki ni ba Saan na Qur'ani ba waka ni achiki ba Si Allah ta'ala ya chi ya saw karmashid al Qur'ani ni Dumin ya zantu abin gargadi Da kuma abin karantawa Li yunzira kawman Li yunzira man kana hayyan Ansa wakad al-Qur'an ini Dumin ya zantu Watu gargadi garayayu Gawadde ki rai Chikim maga bata Suka chayi Qur'ani ansa wakad da shine Ya gargadi duka rai Gabaki da da muslimi da wadda wa muslimi ba da duk wanda ke raye wasu kuma suka ce a a wannan gargadin za a yi wa kowa amma ba kowa ne zai fahimce shi yanzu man kana hayyan domin ya gargadi wadda suke raye rayayyu su ne wadda suka yi imani duk wadda yake yi imani to matace ne shi za zaka ga wadannan suna yawo akan kama kusu amma matattu ne a man kana mayitan fa hayinahu wa ja'alna lahu nuran yamshi bihi fi an-nas kam masabu fi zulumati laysa bi kharijin minha shin zaka hada ne wa'ayar da ke su matattu sai muka rayar da su da imani muka rayar da su da qur'ani muka rayar da su da biyayya ga annabi muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam zaka hada su ga wa'ayar suke bauta gumaka basu haduwa shi sa rayayyen haƙiƙa shine wanda ya yadda da Allah duk wanda bai yadda akwai wanda ya halice shi ba kuma ya cancanci abota mun shi shi kadai mushi Allah to wannan matace ne sai dai amma ya addu'a ya samu rayuwa to shi sa gargadi wanda ke amfani da gargadin za ka samu wanda ke a rayayyake wai hikkal qawlu ala alkafirin sa'an nan kuma azaba ta tabbata akan wato gafar ta yaya domin an kawo hujja an masu bayani an ce ga Allah shi ya halicci sama shi ya halicci kasa shi ya halicci ruwa shi ya halicci kowa da komai kuma shi kamata abota suka ce a'a ba za su yi da to hujja ta gabata 
an masu bayani shi yasa duk bayani da za ka yi wa mutane ba kowa ne zai yadda ba a ko da suna nan ne kawai Allah ta'ala ce inna allazina kafaru sawa'un alaihim a anzartahum am lam tunzirhum la yu'minun khatama Allahu ala qulubihim wa ala sam'ihim wa ala absarihim bishawa walahum adhabun azim Allah ta'ala ce daga cikin mutane su kenan Allah ta'ala ke cewa lalle wa'ai da suka furta daidai ne akan su ko ka gargade su in zar din da ake bayani ana ko ka gargade su ko ba ka gargade su ba daidai ne ba za su yi imani ba saboda me da ganin su da jin su da kwalwan su duba ya amfani ya buga kuma azaba ce ke gidan su shi yasa musulmi ya kara godiya mu Allah da ya rayar da shi to kuma ya kara rayuwa ya inganta rayuwa da karanta alqur'ani da aiki da alqur'ani da karanta tarihin annabi muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam da kuma koyi da shi wannan ita ce rayuwa da za ta hada mutun da rayuwa wadda rayuwa ce cikin wato aminci amma duk wadda bai yi haka ba ko da yana musulmi ne in bai bai da hankali ba sai fada shirka sai fada bid'a sai fada munafurci saboda bai karantu ba Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala ya sanya mu cikin wa'adda idan an gargade su suna dauka yesterday the last verse we read Allah the most high confirmed that or he refuted the claim of the disbelievers that Quran was poetry and the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam was poet the prophet Allah the most high said no Quran was never like that and the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam was not a poet uh, he uh, the Quran is a dhikr reminder and also a Quran will be in the plain Quran that explains things clearly it has been revealed during the ramakana hayyan for the prophet of allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam to warn whoever happens to be alive he whose heart is alive meaning a muslim because even though someone may be a live may be living but if he disbelieves in allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he is equally a non living thing aw man kana hayyan aw man kana maytan fa ahayinahu wa ja'alna lahu nuran yamshi bihi fi an-nas kama mathaluhu fi dhulumati laysa bi kharij minha allah the most has said a parable of someone who is dead of an kana maytan fa ahayna then we give life unto him kama mathaluhu fi dhulumati can this person be equal to someone who is in darkness laysa bi kharij minha and there is no way out for him from that darkness is is not going to be possible so the quran is there to warn those who are alive he who is alive whose heart is alive in the way of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and on the other hand wa yahiq al qawlu ala al kafirin for the word of allah's punishment to be confirmed on the kafirin on those who disbelieve the quran confirmed that whoever disbelieves in allah subhanahu wa ta'ala his abode is certainly going to be hell fire therefore you should accept the quran to be alive we who does not accept or did not accept even though he may be living but he is a kafir therefore his life is useless awalam yaraw anna khalaqna lahum mimma amilat aydina an'aman fahum laha malikun to to kuma sai allah ta'ala ya biyo da wannan aya na ambatan abinda yake yi wa bayan sa na ni'ima musamman na halittar dabobi Allah ta'ala ce awalam yaraw anna khalaqna lahum mimma amilat aydina an'ama shin ba sa kula shin ba su gani ba Allah ta'ala yana so mutane su tattaro hankalin su waje guda shi sa wasu lokuta za ka ga abin yana tahowa kamar ana ba mutum tambaya domin ya tattaro hankalin sa waje guda ya dubi abin da aka ambata ya auna da abin da ya ji Allah ta'ala ce ah shin ba su gani bane anna khalaqna lahum mu muka halitta musu 
mimma amilat aidina abinda hannayen mu suka wato ainin aikata an aman wato ainin dabobi ba sa ganin manyan manyan dabobi da muka halita musu dabobin gida dabobi na kiyo domin shi dan adam saboda ma yadda Allah ya yi mishi ni imomi har na dajin ma yana zuwa ya kamu su ba na gidan ba dabobin gida kan da mun Allah ta'ala ya hore musu irin surakuma irin suraguna irin su ga sunan dai akwaya tunkiya duka wai nan dango gane daban-daban na dabobi na gida da Allah ta'ala ya wa dan adam ga shanu su ma duka Allah ta'ala ya wa dan adam wato ni'ima da su shi ya halicce su da kansa fa hum laha malikun sai ga dan adam yana mallakan wa'annan dabobin yace a wannan nawa ne wannan nawa abin nan nawa ne wannan nawa ne wannan nawa ne kuma dabobin su zauna a tare da su suna yi musu biyayya ba sa wato ainihin tutar da su sai ka samu mutun yana da yana da sa garke garke kuma ke akwai yan wana abin nan fulani a kusa ka nura ma suna kusa sai ga mutun yana da garken shanu goma shi shi kadai ya shiga cikin su ya zaga ya zaga ya zaga babu abin da za su yi mishi hatta ma ya yi magana da su su gane maganar sa shi ma ya gane nasu in ba dan adam in ba Allah ta'ala wa dan adam ni'ima ba sa daya sai ta da masallacin nan daga wannan tafsirin idan wata shuru sheshe sa ta shigo ta wancin kuma da kahonta ina ga ladan ne kawai za a bari a zane saboda tana iya halaka mutum amma saboda ni'imar da Allah ta'ala wa dan adam sai ka samu yaro musamman bukulata ne ko yarinya a shekara goma tana kora shanu dari ita kadai ta kai su kiwo ta dawo da su gida ta yi musu bayani su mata bayani kai idan idan ba Allah ba kai kai suka jarraba wannan shi sai Allah ta'ala yake nuna musu yake nuna mana wadansu ayoyin sa a bayyane saboda mai hankali ya hankalta ya gane cewa shi fafawa ta tsaya bace shi bawa ne kawai to Allah ta'ala ce shin ba su gani ba muka halitta musu wa'annan dabbobin sa'an nan suna mallakan su wato ka lokaci wannan nawa ne dabban ma kuma yadda kai naka ne to saboda haka dan adam ya kamata ya zan musamman musulmi ya zan mai gode ma Allah ta'ala da ni'imomin da ya mana na some of the ni'ima that Allah the most high bestowed on human beings by creating livestock animals meant for our service awalam yarau anna khalaqna lahum mimma amilat aydina an'aman could they not see Allah the most high is asking can you not see our man that anna khalaqna lahum an'aman that we have created for them that is for men for human beings for our own enjoyment for our own comfort mimma amilat aydina we have created from uh, we have created uh, for them an'aman livestock grazing livestock such as camels cows goats sheep and allah the most high made them subservient and subjected them <coughs> to human beings you see uh, a small boy controlling large number of uh, camels or large number of cows and he controls them he shout at them they stop he shout at them they move and they understand him they, they understand him they, she, he also understand them as if they are speaking they exchange they converse between themselves it is only allah who can do this to make an animal subservient to human being despite its strength despite its own behavior it does not know anything like morality or anything like obedience but allah subhanahu wa ta'ala subjected them to the benefit of human beings there used to be a brother who used to come to this tafsir who used to sell lions so to the extent that even allah the most have made it easy even wild animals a person who go to the bush he hunt he kill some of them through hunting he catch some of them he bring them inside the the town that person used to sell lions 
So from the time he told me that he said lions, he told, please don't bring any lion to the mosque because if you bring uh, it will be a disaster. So it is only Allah who can make this possible. Despite their strength, despite their own behavior, they don't know anything like uh, uh, maybe obedience or uh, to be uh, to be subjected to someone's use except with the permission of Allah. So Allah is calling our attention to reflect on this ni'mah. And human beings are owners to those animals. You see a fly man, for example, having a large number of, of, um, of cows and he know all of them maybe by their names or by their shapes and he controls them. This, nobody is doing this except Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So Allah who does this is the one worthy of being worshipped and is the one we should submit ourselves to him just as he made such animals submissive to us and for our own benefit we slaughter them, we sell them to get money and so many other ways we benefit from them. Glory be unto Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for all these his uh, favors. وَذَلَّلْنَا لَهُمْ فَمِنْهَا رَكُوبُهُمْ وَمِنْهَا يَأْكُلُونَ So, yet she وَذَلَّلْنَا لَهُمْ فَمِنْهَا رُكُوبُهُمْ وَمِنْهَا يَأْكُلُونَ Say, muka hore madang Adam muka hore mus watu muki na yang Adam wa enam dabu bang do mengkai da kagera kumi ai kasa nya pekar pendang Adam a che muting yasa ya dalam kumi si pada I can see the change. One can can answer the dogon win. Then you have more to say the lahira. I must say, Gashimara, woman, Mutan is entire day. Were Anna Kiwansu, Anna Anna Horansu, Anna what I mean, Anna Anna Moransu. So what Allah Alachi, ya holy manners. To Bara Umi Kadeva, Dick can win and the moving and Ima Negida, the Allah Alai Huri, Madame Adam. In the Badam Huri, but I don't believe the Sua. Hora will lay out what the Kigan Capish is all. It then ye ye buy a ye shouldn't butter. It ain't to Kurumutin the Naka on Nasa to say the Casa. Someone in a lagoon and lagans were also chirp by chirp. A massacre, then Adam Yakama Yama Laka Yaki water, Yasam would deal with the nation. Allah Ta'ala ce ya hore mana wa'annan dabobin ba wai dan karfin mu ba sai yace daga cikin su akwai na ci daga cikin su kuma akwai na hawa cikin bukatun dan adam a duniya ne akwai bukatun ya ci abinci akwai bukatun ya tafi daga wannan wajen zuwa wani waje to sai Allah Ta'ala ya hore mai wa'annan dabobin za su bashi ina mayaci ya koshi Saan nang rasu bashi Abang hawa tumba mutu chi Tumba jara jen sama Laka samu ana hawang Rakumi yaitu piya deka kasa zuha kasa Ayari Na kasuanchi Ayari na zuha niman karatu Ayari na zuha zamanchi Sika samu ang hawa rakumi Harwa nang suna chi rakumi Ida aka hawa shida Ia wata di shibi shalwa wawa Yaitu kiku makami na wii Yaitu kiku wantu aini me one day, how can the Kumakaya at Abish? The Kumahakulansa, the Kuma Idan Kana Sukas of the Kasama Bakasaka, Inkapato Kari or Laki, Sekaka Yamushi, they are under the Gani, the Dukusa Kasoka, Inyana Tema, Nzaka Hoshi, Tema Yaran, Yaduka Kaushi, Kema the Alamana on the Banaka of the Yah, San Nankuma, Ayankashi, Kukuma Abendan. A sokesh Kuma au Chena man Awada atu nashi Jisa ala ta ala chi daga chiki Kona chi daga chiki kona hawa Wosu da bobong da chi da hawa Deka Kamara kumike na Dada hawi ya iti pia kuma Intakama madha ayanka shachi Kwa a sokesh Haka masa Yudu shi Bana hawa bani gali bi Dama na chini Ama shima Ana kama waka ga anghaw Orang macam akai utah ayu, dah seorang kaya kita dah ay kau rada dengan zaman yang kagak untuk orang waktu ini mana mana yang syarun kaya, semua kuma anak si, hak elon surau guna, semua dah ayangka, elon sur cuma kita, 
su ma za a yanka duk Allah ta'ala ya hore madan adam wannan ya ci wasu ya hau wasu wasu kuma da cin ba da hawan duk Allah ta'ala ya hore mana ba to amma duk da haka sai ka samu saboda karancin imani da karancin karancin rashin yadda da kai bawa ne dan adam sai ya dinga girman kai na'am Allah Moses has said this an arm grazing animals or grazing livestock Allah said we subdued them for them meaning for mankind for human beings for their own benefit lahum fiha rakubuhum fiha fa minha rakubuhum among those uh, livestock are those that human being do right as to serve as source of mobility from one place to another even from one country to another just as you can see caravan maybe from niger even during the lifetime of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam that was the means of transportation and the means of a, a business a caravan from one city to another from one country to another even in nigeria you see from niger to nigeria carrying commodities of a business allah the most high made it easy for human beings to control them in this way if not that allah the most has subdued such animals for us especially uh, livestock like camels how can human being control a camel see how the neck so tall how it is see the head if it hit an individual with, with its head that will be the end of that person except if allah gives him long life but allah the most high made it easy a human being can ask the camel through some mechanism they use to tell it to kneel down at it will kneel down he will load whatever he will load on top of it and then when he finishes loading he will ask the camel to to stand up go to areas like uh, sokoto binnenkebi and others you see how camels are being used as means of transportation in nigeria so allah says wa min harakubuhum from it harakubuhum means of their mobility they ride them from one place to another women haya kulun and from it ya kulun they eat you use it as mobility you use it as means of food like camels you take your load you move from one place to another with it and also if you like you slaughter it you eat so also uh, uh, livestock like um, like uh, cows you eat from them and you load your 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 commodities from one place to another especially if fulani people are moving from one place to another you see all their load will be carried by their cows all this allah subhanahu wa ta'ala made it easy because he is the one who said dallalna halahum we subjected them we made them subservient we subdue them for human beings in order to use this is indeed something worthy of being reflected upon and thanking allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for this ni'ma وَلَهُمْ فِيهَا مَنَافِعُ وَمَشَارِبُ فَلَا يَشْكُرُونَ شي الله تعالى يا شي ولهم فيها منافع sa'an nan ga mutane akwai amfano da yawa abubuwan mu ranar amfani suna da yawa ka ga dazu can mun yi maganar cin naman wayannan dabbobin da kuma hawan su to ba su kadai ba amfanin su yana da yawa daga ciki zaka samu ana amfani da fatun su fatan dabobi ana abubuwa na kwalliya da su da fatun sa'an nan ana kasuwanci a mori kudi a baicin za a dauke su daga waje waje guda a je a saida a waje guda sa'an nan ana aikin gona da su in da kaje wasu har yanzu a kauyukan mu zaka samu wasu wurare ana huda da shanu a abin nan kaga kaga abin nan an yi huda ya fito ral kafin ai shuka bal wannan lokaci ana noma da su bayan goren yayi banya sai a bi kamar huda amma sai ga cewa duk an iya wato ainin ciyayin wannan gonan an nome shi da hudan su sa'an nan ana jigila da su na ko a deban ruwa a kawo ruwa nan daga nan duka ana yin shi bal wasu rare hatta a rijiya idan rijiyan na da yana da tsawo da yawa ana amfani da dabbobi wajen jawo ruwa 
duka wannan ana ana bora su kuma kada irin girman su nan amma su hakura dan adam ya dinga sarrafa su ah Allah tabarak wa ta'ala ce akwai an faru da yawa da ake mura daga cikin wa'annan dabbobin wadda kowane zamani da kowane lokaci a kowane wurare ma daban-daban zaka sha mu akwai irin amfanin da suke mura da wa'annan dabbobin sa'annan Allah tabarak wa ta'ala ce wa masharib da kuma wato ainin sha na nonon su kamar nonon wato sa musamman abinci ne ko mai lafiya mai kuma ba da lafiya shi sa mutanen da zaka samu karfin su ya fi mutanen yanzu saboda daga cikin abincin su nono madara mai kyau ba wanda aka je aka saka shi a cikin firji ya wata uku aka ce ga ranan ya fi hadin shi ba dan wasu sanadare da aka zuba a cikin sa an kwashe dukkan amfanin da dukkan albarkan illa kadan shi sa wanda yake shan nono zaka samu yana da karfi yana da lafiya yana da basira kuma to kage duk yana cikin abin da Allah ta'ala ambata na abin da muke sha haka nan ma raqumi ana shan nonon sa nonon sa hasali ma magani ne wasu ma suka ce hatta fi tsarin shi ma karan kansa magani ne na raqumi kage duk wannan suna cikin manafe har ma ana samu ai ma gunguna da su ana sai da wadin yana cikin manafe da Allah ta'ala yayi mana na amfano samun amfani da wa'annan dabbobin to dan adam saboda karancin lurar sa sai ka samu ana mishi ni'imomi masu yawa baya kulawa masu yawa ba zai ma kula bai san ma da su ba shi yasa karanta qur'ani ga musulmi zaman to dole don wasu abubuwan ma hankalin ka ba zai kawo su ba amma qur'ani sai lura da kai ce kaga amma kaza amma kaza amma kaza amma kaza to me yasa kai ba za ka bauta wa Allah me yasa ba za ka kanka kanka ba me yasa ba za ka daina sabo ba Allah tabarak wa ta'ala yace wa masharib da kuma abun sha afala yashkurun abin da Allah ke bukata a wajen mu godiya kawai bai hana mutun ya mallaki shanu dubu sau dubu ba raquma dubu sau dubu tinkiya dubu sau dubu bai ki ba amma abin da yake so godiya ta ce Allah na gode da kamin wannan ne Allah ina ma godiya wannan ni mumin da kamin na gode kuma idan mutun ya irin wannan godiyan sai Allah ta'ala ya ruban ya mashe kara mashi kaga yanzu mu musamman Najeriya ne wa'annan dabbobin kadai sun isa sai mana arziki a ce ai ta kiwon su a ta kiwon su a ce a ciki a sha kuma a kai ga su wurare wanda ba za su iya ba za su iya samun irin wannan damun ba kenan cikin manafi din su akwai arziki akwai samun wato karfin tattalin arziki ko muta san mu ba me zai hana a ce a shiga kiwo gadan gadan kiwon dabbobi baka da asara a cikin sa gadan gadan a shige shi yana cikin manafi amma sai ka samu mutane su zauna malalata ba aikin yi ana ta jiran gwamnati ga gona ga kiwo an ki ai na qur'ani yana kwadaitar da yana fadin irin amfanon da ake samu yanzu kamfanoni ake yi na madara na nono kamfanoni na nama wanda shi kadai ya isa ba mutane ayyukan yi me zai ina laifi a ce daga abuja har zuwa karshen arewacin kasar na a ce ko wace jiha muna da kamfanoni manya manya na fid da nono waje na fid da nama je waje ana sai da ana sai da me zai hana ba abin da zai hana kuma a shagaltar da matasa su yi ta ayyuka a cikin wayannan kamfanonin me zai hana Allah ta'ala ya mana abubuwa da dama a cikin alqur'ani wadda da inda ana lura da su da ko mu ga nan talauci ba za a yi shi a kasar nan ba Allah ya samu dace bu min dunillahi alihatan la'allahum yunsarun to ni mumin suna da yawa daga cikin Allah ya ambata mana kawai na dabbobin gida sai Allah ta'ala ya ce a wannan ayan wattakhadhu min dunillahi aliha sai suka riki kuma wani abun bauta wadda ba Allah ba ta kuma a ce yanzu dabbobi kadai sun ishe ku tuna Allah ta Allah yana da girma ku rike shi ku bar duk wani sa domin da za a bar ku da dabbobin nan ba za ku iya motsawa ba to wannan kadai ma isa ku ce to lalle mun yadda Allah kai ne ubangiji mu kai kadai za mu bauta ba za mu bauta mu to duk da wannan sai Allah ta Allah ce sai kuma suka bar Allah suka riki mai ne gumaka 
shine abun bautan su wattakhadhu min dunillahi aliha sai suka riki wato ainin gumaka da duk abin da ake bauta na duwatsu ya zama to shine abun bautan su kaga aka san abin da aka samu ba godiya ba yadda ba bi sai aka dauko dutse aka dauko wasu sasaka aka dauko su abba aka maida su su ne abun bauta ba Allah ba wattakhadhu min dunillahi aliha la allahu yunsaruna su ko suna bauta mu wa'annan abban ne domin wa'annan abban su taimake su yaya abin da ka sabo daga daji kai da kanka ka kawo gida ka gyara shi kamai ido kamai baki ya zai zama to ubangijin ka don me ya za a yi a ce dutse haka kawai ka zo ka same shi kana bauta mushi ka ce shine ubangijin ka aka ga akwai tabuwa cikin lambarin akwai shi hankali to laraba maka sun yi wannan daiwa kuma har yau ana nan ana hada Allah ta'ala da wani wajen bauta a wurare daban-daban yanzu ka ji mutun yana bauta wa sa haka da zuwa kai an ci an hore mana shi kai abin da ka ga dama da shi to yayin mutun ya koma yana bauta masa sai ka je India wasu yanzu har kwadi suna bauta wa kwado wannan ta za ka yi da shi aka nuno wani clinic mutane suna bauta wa bera bera yi bera yi kawai suna ta shigalin su kawai eh au bai barna irin wanda a ce mutun ya zanto shine yake ba shi sa dan adam idan ya bar Allah sai ya zamanto gumma dabba ma akan shi ai mu mun gode mu Allah a kasar nan sai ka lai ko su kasashe ga su ga su da wayewa ga su da ci gaba ana cewa mu sala'antu ana cewa waye waye amma ina babu Allah wani hamshaki mai kudi at-tajri ya tafi kasan kafarawa na isa ko na mai waya yana can ne lokacin ko ya min waya ne sai ya ce malamu mun gode mu Allah ina wani waje wadda su gaba dai ma ba mu ganin Allah a cikin labarin su duniya kawai aka sa gaba to kaga irin wannan rayuwa ta zama rayuwa ta asara Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala ya tsare mana imanin mu wa'annan abin da ake bauta ba su iya taimaka mutum da komai ba za su iya ba kai ba za su iya taimaka wa kawunan su to ba sai mutun ya taimaki kansa ba zai taimaki ka lokacin da annabi ibrahim ya sassare su ai ba su iya komai ba ai shi ya ce ku tambaye su wannan wa ya sare su wannan tabbayar ba da yi musu ta zaman to matsala saboda hankulin su ya dawo kawunan su ga kuma ya aje abin nan a ga tari ne ko abin nan a jikin babban babban nasu yace ku tambi babban tun daga shi an sare su an bashi ba sare shi ya me faru su gane ba su da hankali amma duk da haka san da suka gibin annabi ibrahim alayhi salatu wasalam su kai mashi makirci ba da dan allah ta'ala ya tsallakar da shi ba to mutanen da ba su san allah ba babu shakka abin tausayi ne musulmin da ya san allah ya kibin allah shi ma abin tausayi allah ya kara mana imani despite all this ni'ma that allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bestows on human beings which he should reciprocate by worshiping allah the most high knowing that allah is the only one worthy of being worshiped but contrary to that wa takhadhu min dunillahi aliha they have taken beside allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alihatan other other objects of worship la allahu yunsarun so that they will be helped so that those objects of worship will help them out of the difficulties and whatever problem they are facing allah is the only one who can uh, take you out of whatever difficulty you are facing not any other deity uh, so human beings should thank allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and know that he is the one who is perpetual he is the one who assists he is the one who takes an individual out of the problem whatever one should worship either alive or dead that thing cannot help itself <coughs> let alone helping that person that's why idols have never helped their worshipers consider the time of ibrahim alayhi salatu wasalam when he broke so many of his people's idols and when they came they were even asking they should have even asked their objects of worship or even before asking them they should have told them that so so person came and cut us into pieces but they couldn't get it from them 
they were asking, trying to find out who was the person who cut their idol, idols into pieces. Then it was that time they started uh, hearing that it uh, was one young man who was known as Ibrahim. Maybe he was the one. They went and asked him whether he was the one who cut them into pieces. He said, no. Oh, ask them if they can talk. There they declared that, you know that they cannot talk. He said, why should you be worshipping something that cannot talk and cannot even bring any benefit to you? So that was uh, all time. Even now, in the civilized, civilized age, you see people up to this point worshipping idols, worshipping camels, worshipping cows, and so on. There was uh, something that happened not long ago, about two years ago, I cannot remember the country, whereby because the idols could not protect them, they started beating and cutting the idols into pieces. India, yeah? Corona. Yeah, India, during Corona. They pleaded with the idols to, to protect them from coronavirus. But Corona was claiming their lives massively. So they were still pleading, idols, why didn't you protect us? We beg you, we told you that this Corona is moving into us, it's doing this. The idol did not protect them. So they went ahead beating, beating the idols, cutting the idols into pieces, loading them into uh, in their trucks and taking them in, in uh, the ocean. dumping them into an ocean. So you can see even in the civilized period, whereby someone will will, compl will claim that he is now civilized, he is in a computer age, still people do worship idols. A Muslim should thank Allah Subhanahu wa Taala for his limitless favors. Uh, part of which is making him to know that Allah is the only one worthy of being worshipped while some others for them to be assisted but those aliha cannot assist themselves let alone assisting those who worship them we thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the ni'mah of Iman La yastati'una nasrahum wa hum lahum jundum wahdarun La yastati'una nasrahum Shua enanda akibotawa Wa enna nguma kang Da shanu wa usura re Da kwadi Da bera e da akibotawa Mbalasi yetima kama wa enna siki bota musumba Taka ay taka ali Kumada laka zwana da suka chetu when the pair and the cookie water, that's it. You will see a suit. You will compare. I will ask a boy to go in a person. I will never get a man so good as she was. When I can come in a land, what has been like a gashan who sent them when you are your baby, baby, and cash. I can in a go any killing the actor. Uh, so quanta say, Shannon said, then the hard council. So I've been snatched at Takasu. When I can take it, she was in a me, she never leave. Kaga, kaga, and this is the other one. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to show you how ko jinnu ne ko dan adam ne ba su yi makawo junan su Allah ta Allah yace wa min an-nasi man yattakhil min duni Allahi andadan yuhibbunahum ka hubbi Allah walladhina amanu ashaddu hubban lillah walaw yara alladhina zalamu izaruna al-adhabu anna al-quwwata lillahi jami'a wa anna Allah shadid al-adhab istabarra alladhina tubi'u min alladhina taba'u wa raw al-adhab wa taqatta'at bihim al-asbab wa qala alladhina taba'u law anna lana karratan تبرع منكم كما تبرع منا كذلك يريهم الله أعمالهم حسرات عليهم وما هم بخارجين من النار وأن جاي ذا أي شيء بقي أما سكانوا وأدى سكسو وأن سكما يدى سكما يا إنجيل سكما الله سو كم أنا سامو أشك مجاني شسا مكسنع دسوقي دد هاري إنز أنا سامو مورا ليه ودك ما بزواني بس الله بس الأديني تو أنا شيء ما بدي أبون تو واتو هانزري غير موبا الله ذي تنبيم a cikin kasa irin wannan da muke da yawa da muke da karfi da muke da masu arziki da muke da malamai da muke da wato duk abin da ake bawa abu muna da shi musulmai muna da shi amma a ce akwai kasar nan har yanzu ba kudancin kasar nan ba arewacin kasar nan a ce mutane ma guzani ba a kawo musu wannan addinin aka bayyana musu ana nan kawai ana holewa a cikin gari 
to kaga wannan ba daidai bane Allah ta'ala ce gobe kiyama daga cikin mutane wanda suka riki abun bauta ba Allah ba suna san wa'annan abun bautan kamar san Allah yanzu idan ba dan jahili ba ya mutun zai kwanta a ƙasa sa ta dinga tattaka shi a ce wai shine yana ibada ko ba ƙarya bane da gaske an yi ana yi yana son sa kamar yadda ya kamata ya so Allah ta Allah ta'ala ce masu imani su suka fi tsaninin son Allah da wa'annan suka yi irin wannan zalincin gobe kiyama za a nuna musu majigi za su ga azaban Allah gobe kiyama da su wa'annan da suka so wa'ancan din ba ba Allah ba suka ba su matsayin Allah da wa'annan da aka so din gobe kiyama in suka ga azaban Allah to kowanne sai bar antar dan kwansa wa'annan suka yi bautan za su ce ba mu gwaku wa'annan aka bautan za su ce muwa ba mu gwaku haka ai ta baci domin sun ga azaban Allah to wa'annan suka yi bautan su ce ya Allah da muna da dama za mu dawo duniya to ba za mu kuma irin wannan kusura to wannan damun babu ita shi sa masu halin mu da matasan mu ya kamata a bada wato ainin lokaci na ziyartar wa'annan da su ba su ma san wannan addinin ba ba arewacin kasar nan ba har kudancin kasar nan yan sai ka samu mutun yana kudu shi kadai saboda ya karatun sa dai ya gane musulunci sai ce ko zai musulunta bana kisu ma an tayi musu ga danga zuwa suna karantar da wa'annan suka zo nan daga can garin nan suka zo abuja suka musulunta aka ce me yasa abuja suka ce sun fi san nan abuja eh musulunci na abuja ya ka san nan na ake tare abuja ko kowa ne yake so aka ce ko ko a can ma kan da fadi sunan jihar in ku musulunci an suka ce a nan suke so aka ce to ku taho suka taho suka iso suka musulunta a nan masallaci masallaci na kasa na shan box aka yi musu bita kuma da ka gan su ka san da gaske suke ba da wasa ne to irin wannan kokarin ya zama dole a kan mu domin Allah ta'ala zai tambaye mu Allah ta'ala ya samu dace Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala ce da su din da suka yi bautan da wanda aka bautawa to za su halarci azaban Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala Allah ya tsare mu na Allah says they will not be able to assist them in any form the idols that have been worshiped or the cows or the camels or whatever object of worship that human being worship beside Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala la yastati'una nasrahu they will never have any benefit from that worship they dedicate to those idols wa hum lahum jundun muhdharun and they will be brought as a troop uh, against those who worship them those who were worship would be brought before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala then those who worship them will be brought before Allah the most high and Allah will ask whether those who were worship were those who commanded those people to worship them then everyone will dissociate himself between, uh, from the other one استبرع الذين تبعوا من الذين تبعوا ورعوا العذاب وتقطعت بهم الاسباب when those who worship will dissociate themselves completely from those who worship them because they have seen clearly the punishment of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala all relationship all connection between them have been disconnected therefore it is only connection between you and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that will remain forever and that will take you to paradise but any other connection with any material or object that one worship with a uh, claim that that thing will uh, assist him or will help them or will free him for, from Allah's punishment that is going to be lie and he will realize his mistake when there will be no time for him to ameliorate his problem may Allah increase us in iman and save us from disbelief fala yahzun قولهم إنا نعلم ما يسرون وما يعلنون الله تبارك وتعالى شيء ده شيء فلا يحزنك قولهم كذا زنتو كان سبعة جنسو كذا باتا ماري كذا كذا مدرس دمي وسوتي آآ أي ما واقيني كمان دم كذي شام كوسا كوسا ولا نسوي آه أي ما هو كذيني وسوي آي كذا كذا ني بدي ما عنكنو وسوي مسيحيني وسوي آي آي أبينا كذا كذا دو أي نما عنكنو الله تعالى شيء النبي محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم كذا كذا ما دش ولا يزونه كله 
ai idan kana da abun yi baka damuwa da wanda ba yi da to wannan shi ya kamata al'umma ta gane ta damu da abin da ya dame ta kar ta dinga damuwa da abin da ba nata ba in ka shiga damuwa da abin da ba naka ba sai ka bar abin da shine naka kai sai ka kasa yi yanzu al'amura suka ta barbare abin da ya kamata ko wannan mai shine tukunne ya damu da kansa shi mai yayi mai yi gabatar mu Allah da za a ce yau din nan daren nan an dauke ransa ya shiga aljanna mai yayi abubuwan da yayi ya lissafa ya duba Allah ta'ala ce kar ka yi bakin ciki kar ka damu fa la yazun ka kaulu duk zan tukan su da suke yi kar ka damu da shi inna Allah ta'ala ce lalle mu na alamu ma yusuruna wa ma yulinun mun san abin da suke fadi a boyi duka wanda kai baka ma san su ba da makirce makircen su da kulle kullen su dun mun sani wa ma yulinun abin da suke a bayyana ma wanda kai ka san shashi to dun mun sani muna nan a madakata muna jira to shi yasa kada mutun yayi tawon damuwa ci a ai wani shi ya min kaza ai wani shi kar ka damu kai ka ci gaba da yin alkhairi ko tsakanin ka ne da yan uwan ka na gida in aka samu wadan suna ma shari ko suna ma kaza kar ka damu ka ci gaba da alkhairi kuma ka taimaka musu idan mutun yi haka to tun a duniya ma sai Allah ta'ala ya dora ka kan su bare uwa uba idan an je can ai ba magana yawan damuwa yana sa mutun wani lokaci shi ma ya rage himma kar ka samu damuwa ka ci gaba dama haka rayuwa ta gaji a samu kanu bale ta gaji a samu wato ainihin kiyayya gaba kulle kulle duka ta gaji wannan ba ganin annabi yusuf alayhi salatu wasallam an kulla an kulla an kulla an kulla karshe san da ministan dukiya gaba daya na kasa ya kuma kira wasu yace ku zo ku mura arzikin allah to shi yasa dan adam kada ya dai bari dan adam ta kansa ta sa shi ya ta damuwa da abin da bai kamata ya damu da shi wannan tasliya da aka wa annabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam har da dukkan musulmai kar ka damu da wanda yake yake kulle kulle ba zai ke kulla ma komai ba kullan yusi ba na illa ba ka taballahu lana huwa maulana babu abin da zai same ka sai abin da za a can allah ta'ala ya rubuta maka shi allah ya kare mu da imani allah ta'ala ya samu shiga da imani allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is addressing the messenger muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam that do not be saddened by their statements In one of the previous verses we read the kufar claimed that the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam was a poet see the personality of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam for one to accuse him of being a poet this one is something very sad that can make person to be sad they said the quran also is poetry it is enough to make the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam to be sad they said the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam was telling lie this one can make him to be sad they said it is he who invented or he see the author of the glorious quran while he knows that the quran is from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala all this can make the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam to be sad in addition to so many things that the kufar were doing against the success of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam now allah is saying fala yahzunka qawluhum do not be saddened by all the statements they are making against you o messenger of allah inna na'lamu ma yusiruna wa ma yu'linun we certainly know ma yusiruna what they conceal in their heart whatever is hidden inside their hearts of disbelief of belying you o messenger of allah of dishonoring you of uh, disbelieving in you allah says we know what is inside their hearts wa ma yu'linun and what they made open then if allah subhanahu wa ta'ala should know what is concealed by human being what more of that which is made open so allah the most high knows everything concerning human beings what he uh, made open open and what he uh, concealed may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase us in iman in allah and his messenger sallallahu alaihi wasallam this is the point we are going to stop inshallah to continue tomorrow by the grace of allah السلام عليكم ورحمة الله غافر تمالا الله جي كان يا ايه امين كو كدن دا كتباشي دو من كو ايه سناء انا تشري مسو زكاة ما انا باشي مبانكي اه ايه موتنكي لك انا يا تباشي بانكي دو من كو كدن دا كتباشي دو من كو ايه كوكولن ده يشبه شيء. أنا أشرب بس زكاة.
ya mutun ya ci bashi a banki ko domin ya koyi sana'a ko kudin da shi ya ci bashi shi bai tambaya eh shi ya malam mai ci bashin banki ba to gaskiya dai farko karban bashin banki ba dai bane a shari'a musulunci saboda cikin abin da yake karya mutun da wuri wato kudin riba kudi wanda yake akwai riba a cikin sai yana da muni ko riba da albarka wannan kudin mutanen da suke sha idan sun karba kadan nan an samu wannan ma kuma na duniya ne ba san me zai faru a can ba shi yasa mu ce junan mu taimakawa da zamantowa amintattu yadda za ka yi karban bashi a wajen wanda yake da wadata ka yi sana'a kai ma ka zamanto mutun kuma ka maida mashi wannan shi zai taimaki al'umma ya kamata al'umma ta soma tunanin samun wato al'umma amintatta wadda za ka ba mutun dukiya ya je kasuwanci ya zama ya samu daukaka kuma ya maida dukiya to matakar ba mu kai wannan daraja ba aka dinga zuwa banki to kadan in an samu wadda za su yi albarka kuma albarka ma ba a sani ba a can yi me zai kasance saboda Allah bai sorry ba riba mun munan al'amari to amma idan mutum ya karba to shin zai zakka ko ba zai zakka ba dan mutum yana zakkan abin da ya mallaka ne abin da mutum bai mallaka ba ba zai zakkan sa ba sai mutum ya mallaki abin da ya kai zakka kuma ma aka ce ya shekara idan dukiya ne saka a zakka ga wanda ya ciwo bashi to ba za a ce zakkan wannan kudin ba wallahu ta'ala ala Uh, the brother is asking that he he took loan in order to undergo training to learn a particular uh, business. So is he going to pay the cash from that money uh, he collected as a loan? Uh, answer to this question is that uh, one should try his best to see that he avoids taking loan from the bank. because it attracts usury that is riba and whatever is uh, usury is is involved in Allah the most high will take away barakah from it therefore a muslim should avoid as much as possible taking loan from the bank because they will not just give you a loan in as form of assistance rather it must tra- attract a particular percentage which you will return as an increase on top of what they have given you on the issue of zakat you can only give zakat on what you possess if a particular amount of money belongs to you and it's spent one year complete and it reaches nisab then you pay zakat on that money now you are even indebted are you going to take debt also to give zakat again so the answer is that zakat is not binding you should not pay zakat on loan you have taken uh ab um, tambaya ta gaba ce yana buka uh, yana bukatan addu'a saboda akwai wani yana so ya cuce shi ya amsu wasu kudin sa oh, har ya ma insha wasu kudin sa yana bukatan addu'a saboda akwai wanda yake so ya cuce shi har ma ya karbi wani bangare na kudin sa to Allah ta'ala ya yi amen yanzu a Nigeria ba da kudi sai kai hattara kar ka mutun ya zo kaman ustazu ya ce ka basha sai kai bincike abubuwan sun ca kudi yanzu yanzu in ka jina ba a rai daban-daban na mutane masu addini amma kuma gashi abubuwan an zo magana dukiya abu ya lalace sai aka ai hattara shi yasa na ambaci aminci kafin da kikan al'umma shine sunan to amintattu sa'an nan a tsakanin mu in akwai aminci sai masu shi su taimaki wadda ba su da shi nan da nan da za ka ce wa al'umma ta fita daga cikin talauci amma idan ba aminci mutun ya ba ka abu kai wadare shi mutum bai baka ba ka bokai wadare shi yanzu an kai ga ihara suna fid da kudaden iyayen su a banki ba tare da sanin su ba saboda IT din nan to kaga in ba aminci to al'amura duk ga baki daya riki cewa za ta yi Allah ya kare maka kuma ya sa ya maida maka kudin ka tambaya ta biyu ce idan mutun zai kara aure dole ne sai yayi wa uwar gida kayan daki ko a'a to dan ka zauna lafiya a shari'a musulunci ba dole bane wacce zaka aura ita ce zaka ba ta sadaki amma wacce ta gida ba dole bane amma 
musulunci bai hana kyau tutawa ba to asinu inna allah yuhibbul musulun ko dan ka kyau tutawa kowane irin kyau tutawa allah yana son ba su kyau tutawa to wani lokaci idan ka gari mata za ta jawo maka to gwamma ka yi mata ba ma kaya ba ka cika dakin nata dukan komai dan a huda a samu zaman lafiya allah ya samu daji so on the your first question is no question you are asking for prayer may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help you out from he who wants to uh, harm you by collecting your money and maybe in the end you will not return it second question concerning if you intend getting married to a second or third wife you say is it necessary that you you furnish your your first wife's room and buy her so many things is not compulsory for you to do that but it is part of goodness for you to do it <coughs> if you do it is good in order to find uh, peace in, in the house but uh, some women even if you fill the whole of her bedroom with whatever she can even set it on fire and continue her trouble with you May allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect all of us Amen. Don Waike, what is the Islamic position regarding Western world's stand on animals' rights, which they feel that Muslims disregard animals by slaughtering and other benefits we derive from them, as you mentioned from the Quran? If you are looking the right now, the Bobi, Misali, Allah to Allah, she, Mana, she, Mana, Hawa, but you believe how the body is treated this. yana da karfin zai dauka har na ambace rafu mai yana da juriyan da aka ce zai iya wata da bai shawa ba to kage duk Allah ta ala ya mashi wannan abubuwan a cikin sa dan yayin iya dauka saka ba shuddar da shi bane amma in aka zo ga abin da yake da wahala ba a yadda mutun ya wahal da dabba ba a shara mu sai dauki misali yanka da Allah ta ala ce ya mana su mu ci manzo Allah sallallahu alaihi karantar da mu cewa idan zaka yanka dabba sai ka wasa wukar sa'an nan ka wasa in ka bo yankawa ka yi sauri kar ya dade kar zafin yi maryawa kaga wannan shine shine kuma rai da kafin rai ba su da yanka su sai dai a buge wani lokaci ko a dauki sanda amma ka mushi ko kawai a rayi ma a jifa shi kawai a cikin wani oven kaga ba ba dai bane mu muke da wannan kulawa da dabbobi domin za a baka lada a dukkan abin da ka mushi da alkhairi kuma za a baka zanubi in ka cutar da shi mu saboda haka mu muke da animal right ma ba ma ganin ma human right tunda gashi a bayyane a karara wata rana mun je wata kasa Malawi sai muna yawo a cikin daya daga cikin garuruwan su da shigan mu na musulunci sai suka fito waje mu baki ne sai aka fito waje aka mana yaran garin aka ce mu zo mu yanka dabbobi ha mu ce yaran go suka ce su a garin duk wani yankan da za a ko ina ne musulmi ne zai yanka domin shi musulmi shi ne iya yanka ba za a samu matsala su ka ba sai da musulunci ba amma sun yadda musulmai ne suke da yankan da ba cutar ba mu baki ne ba ma samu ba tunda mun shiga irin shigan musulmai mu ma mu zo mu zo mu yanka kaga duk wannan yana tabbatar da cewa musulunci addini wanda yake yana kula da gada na warais premium quality na warais mil suka dauki nauyin kawo muku na warais premium quality dan danon irin na daban ne ina ma abuta dillanci shinkafa da masen daidai ko sari warai kuna iya samun shinkafar na warais a nawo complex kusa da next shopping center kado district dake abuja nigeria kuna iya ziyartar ma ofishin mu dake floti mai lamba 807 gidado address way dake edo industrial area and extension fct abuja kazalika kuna iya tuntubar mu kai tsaye a lambobin karta kwana 0700 uku bakwai daya biyar tara tara ko sufuli takwas daya daya takwas tara biyu daya tara bakwai biyu ko sufuli takwas sufuli uku shida biyar shida daya tara uku tara na warais premium quality shinkafa ta ce shinkafar ku ce garanti gangariya abinci daidai da lafiyar jiki na warais mill na maraba da mai siyan daidai ko sari na warais mill suka dauki nauyin kawo muku